Erev Shabbos Kodesh Parshas Va'era. Pharaoh's opening words. Mi Hashem Asher Eshma Bekolo. Who is God anyway that I should be listening to his voice? You see, Pharaoh was born a Pharaoh. His father was a Pharaoh. His grandfather was a Pharaoh. In their minds, they controlled everything. They controlled life and death. They controlled the economy. They even thought that they controlled the Nile, which, of course, irrigated and gave abundance to that whole fertile crescent. Pharaoh, in his mind, was God. Moses, Moshe Rabbeinu, confronts him as an emissary of the real God and said, Pharaoh, you're not God. There's a creator in this world. Pharaoh, who do you think you are to be enslaving millions of people and to be killing hundreds of thousands of babies? Who do you think you are, Pharaoh, to be able to control or to think you can control humanity and take human rights away from millions of people? Pharaoh was astonished by this. Mi Hashem, you mean I'm not God? You mean there's something that I'm not allowed to do? Moshe was the ultimate iconoclast. Besides for being able to lead the Jewish people out of Egypt, and besides for being able to split the sea, he was able to break through the iron wall of the heart of Pharaoh and prove to him, prove to him that he was not the ultimate power for for us. For us, we need to always be ready to re-examine our values, re-examine our routines, and even if we've been doing something for generations, you know what? It may just be wrong. And for the Moses within all of us, for the leaders within us, for the humans within us, We need to be able to guide the world. We need to be able to look at the greatest icons straight in the eye and say, no, no, no. There's truth in this world. There's values in this world. There's a God in this world. And we're going to make it happen. Shabbat Shalom. Umibarach.